Do you have private student loans? Then listen up, because we might have some good news for you in this week's roundup. If you have variable rate private loans, you could see your minimum payment go down slightly within a month or two, thanks to the Fed's recent rate cut. Fixed rate loans, including federal loans, will not be impacted, however. In other news, two major court rulings are expected within a few weeks on the Education Department's newest attempt at student debt relief for borrowers with older loans or who attended low-value programs. Additionally, the SAVE plan remains temporarily blocked, and you can only enroll in an IDR plan by contacting your servicer or via a paper application. We'll keep you posted on all of these lawsuits as they unfold. And finally, we are just days away from huge changes to the student loan system coming on October 1st. The repayment grace period, or on-ramp, which was implemented after the COVID-19 payment pause, and the Fresh Start program for defaulted loans both come to an end. Going forward, missing payments will incur late fees and harm to your credit. Missing payments without a deferment or forbearance for nine months will result in default and voluntary collections on your wages, tax refunds, and Social Security indefinitely. Those with loans in default have a limited time to use Fresh Start to rehabilitate their loans, repair their credit, and much more. Visit our website to learn more about these programs and how to enroll in an affordable repayment plan that earns credit toward federal discharge programs and are eligible for short-term relief when needed.